Hey, how's it going? Well, I've been going to discussion forums since BBS days, since you had to, you know, go dial up to, uh, you type an ATDT into a terminal and then the phone number, and then you connect, and then it's all text that, that you can actually watch print across the screen because that's how slow the connection is, right? The all text days, where the only graphics were ASCII text, right? Yeah, I've been doing online forums since those days, and I've seen forums come and go. I've seen decent forums turn to crap because they stop moderating. Now, decent moderation is where if it goes too far off subject, a moderator will come in and say, hey, we need to bring this back on subject. Or if it starts going into insults, hey, stop it with the insults. We need to get back on subject. You need to discuss the topic at hand, right? That's good moderation. What's bad moderation is obviously when, I mean, there's like a political compass of sorts to moderation. You can have overly moderated, you can have underly moderated. And then you have people that are, that moderate in a biased sort of way, where they'll, if some, it's, oh, it's, they only moderate stuff that comes from the right, or they only moderate things that come from the left. Now, granted, I, I don't see, I haven't seen very often people who only moderate those that are on the left. It's usually the other way around. It's usually, you know, when it gets biased, it's people on the left over moderating people that are on the right. But when there's no moderation and it turns into just a basic, basically a big insult fest where the only people that are left because everyone else leaves, the only people that are left are the people that like to insult, that's an echo chamber. Just like a forum that, that only moderates one side, yeah, that's an echo chamber. Okay, and some of you would like to say, well, it wouldn't be an echo chamber, the, the unmoderated wouldn't be an echo chamber if all the pussies would just put up with the insults. They're not. No matter what you say, they're not going to put up with that. Pure and simple. They will leave. The people that want reasonable discussion will leave. Again, I've, I've watched this happen for 30 years. Okay, they will leave. And all you have left is an insult fest. Most people don't want to deal with that. The fact that you're wanting to call them pussies because they don't want to deal with that kind of shows a bit about your mindset. You're probably one of these people who like to insult people all the time. So, having said that, as I said before, dissenter is a place for insults. It is not a place to have reasonable discussion. Doesn't matter how much you think things should be. It doesn't matter how much you virtue signal how things should be. Or it doesn't matter how you say, oh, well, well, I'll have good discussion. I'm willing to have good discussion. Well, that, that doesn't help all the rest that don't. Now, there are still places online where you can have reasonable discussion. They're usually smaller forms. Uh, one of the ones that I'd recommend is Political Wrinkles. You know, I, I was on there for years. I haven't gone there nearly as much in recent years. But I, you know, just checked. They're still there. I mean, I, I posted on them a few times last year. Um, but they're reasonably moderated. You know, if, if you go too far off subject, they'll try to bring it back. If you go too much into insults, they'll try to bring it back. You know, but there are plenty of discussion forums still out there if you're looking for them. You're just not going to find them in places like YouTube, Twitter, Facebook. They're too big. And that's one of the problems. Trying to moderate a platform that's that big, yeah, you're going to, it's going to probably be bad moderation, poor moderation. And unfortunately, a lot of the ways that these things get moderated is based off of uh, the type of bullying you find from the right and not the type of bullying you find from the left. So it tend the moderation seems to be 
tilted in favor of the left. Now, you can say, you could, you could feasibly say that that's an echo chamber. Okay, that, that's fine. You, you can state that, and you'd probably be right. But that does not apply to a lot of these smaller forums. So if you really are looking for, for reasonable discussion, where people aren't being censored like that, look into smaller forums. They're still out there. They may not give you as much satisfaction as, as going to the big places, but they're still out there. So if that's what you're looking for, do a little searching. You'll, you'll eventually find something. Just saying.